30th, which is Rico's birthday. Happy birthday, Rico. Thank you. <laughs> so Rico has just finished cooking and uh, I have just finished cleaning. Well, I've not actually finished yet. I'm still tidying everything up. He's done his delivery. So we've decided to have a little sherry. What did you say to me, Rico, when you, about the sherry? What did you say? He said, we're really, what? We're getting old. We're <laughs> 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 Anyway, cheers. Cheers. Is it nice? It is nice. Are you uh, deciding what you're going to have next? I, w I think we'll have a wee glass of this later. Okay, okay. right, put it in the freezer. Put it in the freezer. Freezer. I'll put it in the freezer. I haven't had a sherry in years. Mm. Quite sweet, isn't it? Oh, it's a sweet sherry. Oh, is it a sweet sherry? Yeah. The pale, pale cream. Cheers. Cream sherries are normally sweet. But I've got teal pepe in the in the garage as well. It's nice, nice Still. sweet change. <laughs> right, back back to the cleaning. This is the sherry we've just had. It's actually really well chilled. It's nice, nice little aperitif. Okay, here we go. Ruth has brought in her kofta. This look at this. Yes, still that proud mother-in-law. They look great. What? Did you help mummy make the kiftedes? No, I was not helping. That's fine. You made the cake, didn't you? <gasps> Did you make a cake as well? Yeah. Wow. It's so nice and smooth. I'm not even like that. Huh? Don't let me goose. So we are just frying up some chips right here. Some salad, and we're going to have a Ruth's kofta, which she made for her father-in-law's birthday, didn't she, Rico? No. Nope. I just going to say they need to eat them. And Georgie, Georgie went oh, to see. You? Where did you go? You went to see the Christmas lights today, didn't you? Go show them your. Go and get your wee uh, flashy thing. What's it called? What are they called? There it is there. You got that today, didn't you? When you saw the Christmas lights being turned on. So because Georgie went to uh, see the lights being turned on for Christmas, we have an advent calendar, which we're opening up before December. That's okay, right. Choose a number. Don't look, just pick one out. Okay, I'll put, right, put one back. Right, what number have you got? Have a look. Seventeen. Right, so you have to find that same number here. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. No way! Did you find it already? Oh my god! Wow. So you can open that one. Stand back so I can get you. You didn't do that, Mark. <laughs> Those are too dry. That'll be a bit too many breadcrumbs. Right, go. You can open seventeen. What is it? Let me see. Wow. Georgie, let me see you. <laughs> Georgie, where are you going? Georgie, turn around. Georgie. <laughs> Whoa, watch! What are you doing? Okay, no, you get the Christmas stuffs for Christmas Day! I have to try that one on. I, you've got that one, I bought you that one last year. There's nothing else, right? Come down. Um, <laughs> That's for the Christmas tree. That's for yeah, yeah's chocolate Christmas tree. When we, yeah, when we put it up, you can help yourself. That's Lily's stocking. Um. Right, come on. Right, put all the others back. <laughs> Your bubbles in the way. Right, you can put it on now. Oh, oh, oh. oh the bad boy run down me. That is Bruno. <laughs> Good morning. 
morning and welcome to the 21st of February. It is booster day for me. Um, yeah, so I get my third jab today. I'm quite nervous. Apparently you get the flu as well and I've never had the flu before. Anyway, I have organised my house. We had a lovely, lovely night last night with Ruth, Georgie and George. It was really lovely. They came round and they cooked all that. And it was just really lovely. So today, we're going to put the final touches on the rental and then having photographs taken and we'll be going up on the market. I'm just going to go and refill our coffee. Rico is already there. I was kind of hoping to get a washing out. He thought he'd put it on. I'd shouted from him up, says I'd got it ready and I says to him, put it on. I thought he'd heard me so I was kind of pottering about up, says I've had my makeup till the washing finishes and I can get it out because it's a lovely day. It's cold but it's sunny. Um, but he, he obviously didn't hear so I think I'm just going to go over to the house and do what I need to do. Um, and then come back. I'm going to get changed as well. I mean, I've just got old clothes on just now. So I don't want to go and get my vaccine in these old clothes. But it just depends on time as well. It just depends how much time. I have an outfit ready to go to get changed into. So come home, shower, get changed. So I'm planning on wearing these shorts, my long shirt and a body, which is sleeveless, which makes it easy for the vaccine. If I can incorporate this bill, I will, which I absolutely love. This was such a great find from Kelly. I really, really love it. Just elevates an outfit. That's a new word, isn't it? Elevate. There you go. So I don't know if it'll be too much, but also I've left it out because I do really, really do like it. The bag, I'm still carrying this. Yesterday I was carrying it with kind of a puffer jacket, which is quite slidey, but there's a knack to holding this. There's a, You kind of push it and hold it back with your um, and it kind of um, holds it there. Also, I've exchanged all the pyjamas. I can't remember if I've told you, but that's done as well. Georgie is finding this box very, very, very exciting at the moment. She basically wanted to spend most of the night up here just going through the box time and time again and she loves to dress up in fact both my granddaughters they love the whole dressing up bit I and mean, she's wearing glasses and everything she absolutely loves this I've got her next week for two nights so no doubt she'll be in that <laughs> anyway I think I am gonna make myself a quick coffee and I'm just gonna drive up to the house and then just come back to get the washing out so I'm not wasting time because I'm done in here everything is spotless. Might have another piece of uh, this cake that George made. It's absolutely delicious. It's got those biscuits on the top. I know. I know I should be but What are you saying? Are we going bye bye in the car? Do you want to come? Tell me do you oh uh-huh, is that a yes? Okay, let's go bye bye in the car. Come on then, let's go. <laughs> 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 I just, we're laughing because I saw somebody walking us to record like she's got a Santa hat on actually it was just a woolly hat okay we are on our way we are on our way for the booster oh my god well Rico's absolutely fine after his which was last week was it last week you had yours uh, two weeks now no it was last week a week passed the first day that passed all right anyway 10 days 10 days ago Rico had his and he was absolutely fine so now it's my turn do you know I was really really nervous with the first one second one I just it didn't bother me with this one I haven't really had time to think about it and uh, my letter didn't actually come through I just decided to book it because the last ones we had our second ones it was only a week difference between Rico and I although his did come in slightly early and I don't know if it's because he had the flu jab last year whereas I wasn't um, entitled to it last year because I was too young for it so um, so I don't know if that's why he got his slightly earlier anyway I'm expecting. Ask you if you want your flu jab as well. Yeah, I'm going to take it. If they ask me if I want it, I'm going to take my flu jab. So anyway, I went online and booked and booked my vaccine. Yeah, well, Rico <laughs> went online and booked my vaccine. Okay, let's make it clear. Rico went online and booked booked my vaccine. So 
officially I should be getting mine the 27th of this month which is next week so it's okay anyway so I've not really had time to think about it because I, I, I've been cleaning all morning with Rico so yeah so went home changed and off to get the vaccine now and I'll let you know how I get on good morning and welcome to Tuesday the 23rd of November first of all let me give you an update of my vaccine I'm feeling fantabidoozy no I'm not uh, so had the vaccine on Sunday got a really really this this car's so long it's not giving me enough room for the camera oh I should have put it on my thing because it turned out never mind um what was I saying yeah so got the vaccine on Sunday and I got a really really sore arm like the worst out of all the vaccines that I've had I mean it was like even moving my arm was so but it was okay I was told to keep moving my arm so yesterday I went to the gym I did weights it wasn't it was painful but I didn't lower my weights I kept my weights by last night I was zonked like I could not keep my eyes open but then I couldn't sleep on Sunday night so that could have added to the fact that I was really really tired yesterday so I, I couldn't sleep till about after three on Sunday when I eventually fell asleep um, and yesterday I felt oozy and but you know it never stopped me from doing my usual things but I was feeling tired um, so this morning I woke up my arm is much better I do feel as if I've had a vaccine in my arm but I mean I'm, I'm holding my camera up and all of that and it's absolutely fine um, so yesterday I just felt as if somebody had given me a right good punching in my arm that's that's the only way I can describe it every time I moved it it was painful but anyway I can move it today it's absolutely fine and it's only painful now if I touch that area we are on our way now to do final touches to our rental and just take some photographs and that's us that's why we are up and about early and then it's cleaning downstairs day because you know how no it's not it's cleaning upstairs day because i cleaned downstairs now on uh on a <laughs> on a monday <laughs> i also have my baby here so that's what we've been up to that's the update of the vaccine and that's our update so I'm managing to tick off most of my to-do list as well for November I've got the cupboards to finish which I'm really hoping to get done by the end of November and the silver we're gonna do the silver recall it's really hard trying to fit it in the silver takes half a day doesn't it not at all. Not at all. Okay then, you remember that when I said to you, let's do the silver? I'll do it when I want to do it, right? <laughs> <laughs> so normally, Rico cleans the silver because he's got this magic solution that he just dips everything in. And I'm cl I clean out the unit and organise everything while he's doing the silver. Okay, that's us just arriving now. Welcome to my new house. Woo right. <laughs> Dear me. So if you've been watching me on Instagram, you will have seen some real filthy fridges that I was cleaning. So we had the photographer in yesterday because I keep fridges and everything open. So the photographer must have closed everything off. Look at that. Spotless, people. Spotless. Spotless. There we go. Were they closed? Yeah, and the door was closed, so... They came in. Yep. Right. Here we go. Let's put the light on. Here. How is that? Right. Make. Beautiful. What make is this? Hot point. Lily making herself at home. Aren't you, Lily? Oh. So this is the only job we've got left just to change the doors here. These are actually like flimsy curtain so I want to get them changed because they'll just cause me more problems than they're worth so I've got the joiner booked in to get some nice doors in this cupboard here woohoo there we go Ugh. spotless 
Yes, when I send it to him, it shows up green. You're not happy in here? No? <laughs> Come on, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Do you know, I've had a busy day. I've had a real busy day. So, left the house, came back here, started cleaning upstairs because it's Tuesday and we now clean upstairs. And um, I had to keep reminding myself of that, by the way. So, because I'm such a person of routine, so when I break my routine, it's like, oh, oh, oh. Okay, Lily and I are just back from a walk, but when I left the house, came back here, like I said, started cleaning, then I went to the gym, then I left the gym, then I went to Next to exchange my lamp because the one that I got was a bit dodgy, I felt, but we will find out when... I unbox this if this is the same and if it is I'm just gonna leave it but I got to next and I had the other lamp with me and I forgot the receipt or I picked up the wrong receipt so I just went in and just didn't mention the receipt but they they took it back and refunded my money because it was just back on my card anyway um so that's that oh that says £48. I'm sure I paid £50. Interesting. Okay, I'll need to check that on the receipt. I need this is what I picked up from Aldi's. Just my usual bits and pieces. Okay, yeah. this is what I picked up when I went in for dinner. So, we are going to have this barbecue roast pork fillet. So it is fillet of pork and it's probably just yeah it's coated in spices and cooked in a barbecue sauce thought i'd give it a try never tried it before i think it was about four pounds thought i'd make cauliflower roasted cauliflower because that's my favorite some turnips because i love them a few roast potatoes and some carrots that's like my favorite veg to have i picked up some crumpets i'm gonna have one of them just now because i've actually not eaten yet and it is four o'clock and i've not had a thing to eat in there i've thrown in my uh, coffee pods to recycle i got six raspberry butterfly cakes thought they look yummy and i got two caramel donuts there we go and oh i saw these as well so i thought i'd give these after eights a wee try i'm gonna keep them for christmas orange and mint mmm interesting you know you have to have after eights at christmas i've already picked up my minty after eights you know like your traditional after eights i've already picked them up for christmas and put them by i always like to pick up this organic 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 pinot grigio when i see it in aldi's not off it's not always there but i do prefer organic because they're better for us women i think they're just better generally because some it's, some it's something to do with breast cancer and organic wines it's better to have organic wines I got some biscuits caramelized biscuits and I needed some tea lights these were 199 milk and cookies 36 scented tea lights so I just picked them up because I saw them in Aldi's and that's my ditto because I have just sprayed everything and Daniel I am still using this I haven't forgotten like I said I'm been using it and using it and you would have probably noticed sometimes I forget to put it back on the shelf but um, yeah, so I'll do a what's in my bag and an overview of the uh, uh, of the GST a Grand Shopping Tote. There we go. So um, I'm now gonna have my coffee. I'm gonna toast one of these crumpets just to have and try and just have the one because normally when I get this hungry, I eat everything. In Good sight. morning and welcome. We think it's the 24th of November. We're nearly just a month away from oh, Christmas. Yes, oh, where is it? There, it's up there on your yard's desk. So Georgie's opening her special advent calendar, which she only opens when she comes here. So we're going to choose a number. Okay. What number have we got? Let me see. Oh, you need to find number 23, which looks like that. Let's see if you can find 23. There we go. There you go. Look, that was 
Oh, is that all her friends? Barbie's friends. What's what's his name? Ken. 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 It's ready. Quick before Lily gets it. I cannot get it. Push it from the back. Oh. Uh, what's on it? A reindeer. A reindeer. No. Wow. Mm -hmm. So Georgie's choosing a toy. So this is now where we keep the toys. <laughs> Georgie says it's better, isn't it? Because you can reach them all, can't you? You don't have to wait for us to get them from the top of the cupboard. Can that I one. With that one? Oh, I think that one's just maybe a little bit too hard. But I didn't do it at all. I didn't look at a picture. Oh, you can look at the picture? Yeah. Why don't we try and do one that's a little easier? Oh, what about that one? Uh -huh. I mean the one. You like them ones, don't you? What about that one? Okay, we can try that one. We got to do that one in a long, long time. You've not done that one in a long time? No. Okay, well, let's do that one then. You want to bring that one out? But what about that one? Well, wait. Do that one another day, because that's a little hard. But I can do well, that. Let's, yeah, well, let's try... Th Okay, well let's try this one first and see how you get on with that one. Okay? I all by Okay, you do it all by yourself. Would you not like to come out of the bed to do it? I think you'll be a little more comfortable if you did it outside the bed. Oh my goodness me, that is amazing. How quickly did you do that? Oh, that five minutes. I, it wasn't even five minutes you did that so quickly. Well done, one you. One minute. Wow. Not one minute. You did that one as well? I think you've got a little secret fairy in there that's helping you do them. Yeah. Uh, my baby. So basically I have to go out the room until she does uh, the jigsaws. What, what are you looking at? Is that all the little fairies? Yeah, that all the wee baby has. Oh, right. So the help me play when we find my tail. Oh, the fairy. Like oh, right. Okay. So, George is saying she doesn't like being by herself, so she plays with the fairies. They come to play with her. Oh, that's so lovely. Oh, are they tiny? Yeah. Can you actually see them? Yeah. Can you describe one to me? Is that a wee window? Okay. Can you describe one of the fairies to me? I'm open the door. Can you? Right, does does your fairy have wings? Yeah. What else? Uh, uh, yeah, I Has it, is, it, is, is she wearing a long skirt or a short skirt? A big A big skirt, a big puffy one. Does she have a wand? Wow. Okay, so she's going to attempt this one now, but I have to go out because the fairy's held. <gasps> wow, you got glitter? Yeah. Fairy glitter? Mm-hmm. What else do you like? A bell. The bells? No Hi, my dear. Look. Yeah? I see. Georgie decided she wanted stickers, unicorn stickers, and magic super soft clay. Hmm. This shows you the different colours you can make when you mix them. And we've left this mess behind. <laughs> <laughs>